He's heading up one of the most famous basketball programs in the nation. But will John Calipari venture into the political world? Our Bill Bryant has the answer in his political notebook. Good afternoon. A lot of Kentucky coaches have dabbled in politics from time to time. The retired Joe B. Hall has frequently campaigned for candidates across the state. Rick Pitino appeared with Bill Clinton on election eve in 96, although he said he was just there to welcome the president to campus. What about John Calipari? Coach Cal has donated to candidates from time to time while in Memphis. His contributions have been to both Republicans and Democrats. And once in a while he apparently allowed fundraisers in his home and occasionally offered up advice on a few issues confronting the region. After all, he's written several books. During his news conference, Calipari made reference to how the celebrity status of the U.K. uniform has put at least one former player on a political path. They tell me Richie Farmer, who scored against us, is like the Secretary of Agriculture. They take care of these kids. Is that right? Am I saying that? Is that right? The guy scored baskets. He's going to be governor. I mean, it's crazy. As we've reported here previously, Richie Farmer, who is a Republican and now the Ag Commissioner, is testing the waters for a 2011 run for governor. House Speaker Greg Stumbo says it was a provision requiring the hiring of Kentucky workers that killed a tax incentive bill for expansion of the Kentucky Speedway. Stumbo says the House insisted on the provision, but Senate President David Williams says his chamber removed it at the request of the track's owners. Williams says the owners said they needed very specialized work for some of the expansion project who were only available in other states. But Stumbo says tax incentives should only go to lure jobs for Kentuckians. As Williams continues to ponder a U.S. Senate bid, incumbent Republican Senator Jim Bunning is scheduling more fundraisers for April. Fellow Baseball Hall of Famer Tommy Lasorda will be in northern Kentucky Saturday. Mississippi Governor Haley Barber, a former Republican national chairman, will appear on April 16th. And three state senators whose leader in the legislature is Williams are among the Bunning co-hosts. Senators Ernie Harris, Dan Syme, and Gary Tapp are on the Bunning invitation. We've confirmed U.K. President Lee Todd for Kentucky Newsmakers after the big week in Wildcat Athletics, and Keeneland legend Ted Bassett will also appear. First running of that is Saturday morning at 11. Bill Bryant, WKYT, 27 News First.